All right, welcome back to Sasquatch Syndicate. Uh, thanks for being here, and thank you so much for joining our channel and subscribing. We couldn't do it without you guys. No, we couldn't, and thank you guys so much for tuning in. We much appreciate it. So tonight on Sasquatch Syndicate, we're going to look at a video in the theater, and it was sent in um, from uh, one of the listeners. So let's jump in the theater and take a peek. Let's take a look. All right, well, welcome back to Mystery Sasquatch Syndicate Theater. And in this video, you're going to see a tree line up there in northern Alberta. And apparently, there's a creature here. Yeah, there is. And he's throwing a big-ass pole of some sort. All right, so you can see along the tree line, we got a dark creature on the bottom left. Yeah. And it looks like he's throwing a potential tree like a spear, but he really gives it a good... Gives it quite a healthy huck. <laughs> right. Like a big, small birch tree or something. And you see it like just peek up over that little ridge right there and just giving it. <laughs> That's, it's kind of hard to tell the scale on this, but. All right, let's jump out and talk about it. I like this one. It's blurry, but it, there's something there. I mean, it, it's it looks sizable and... It's a pretty big branch or sapling or whatever. It's <laughs> just giving it a good javelin toss at these guys, you know? Yeah, I think I would love to recreate that and see how far a human could throw that branch. Right. But it was pretty good size. Like you said, it could have been a three-inch bird, right, that it tossed. But it tossed it a good 30, 40 yards. <laughs> quite a, yeah, quite a ways. You know, so it wasn't uh, anything to sneeze at. <laughs> no. No. I mean, it's like pretty solid so so what do you think scale of believability scale one to ten this thing is uh, down on the tree line it sees something encroaching its territory and you know we've heard oftentimes about rocks and trees sure. and things but for one to grab a like i said a three inch birch and toss it like that what do you think yeah it's kind of a di I mean, I'm, uh, oh boy, do I put it on the scale? I'm, am I rating this one? Is that what I'm doing right now? Yeah, what do you think? I'm going like, seven. Yeah, I'm giving I'd it a go seven. a solid seven. I'm down with that. It's. I think that that's realistic, um, you know, for what we know about it. It was a short clip again. We didn't get to see the whole beginning. We didn't get to see the whole end. It so. doesn't come off hoaxy to me. No. At all. It's like something was going on there and somebody had presence of mind enough to say, what's going on, you know, and got enough of it. So on this one, I'm going to forgive a little bit of the forward and back end of this because I think it was just something that happened in the moment and somebody had the presence of mind enough to say, hey, I got to get this on video. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'd guess that a human would probably throw that about 10 to 12 yards before it hit the ground. It's mm -hmm. not like they had a trebuchet out there behind the trees <laughs> slinging this thing, right? Well, you're giving humans more credit than me. This human couldn't do it. <laughs> but, I mean, to grab it, even if you grabbed it by the stump and the roots, right, and you had it, like sure balancing a pole and you were able to give it a good you know throw and it like doesn't look like it was standing up it looked like it kind of did it from a crouch or over a ridge it's kind of hard to tell but right either way it's a pretty good toss i mean someone if they were like a potential like they threw discus in high school or something or sh shot put or something to be able to throw it like that but then i mean it's not like i said you're in a costume potentially if you're trying to hoax it and right. trying to grab this thing and throw it with that much force just doesn't look hoax. Doesn't look practiced. No, it doesn't. This I think there's something there. Whether there is something there or not, I don't know. I, I again seven, seven and a half, maybe. I might even up a little bit, kind of convincing myself it's a little better than I think. All right. Well, we want to know what you guys think. So, right. thanks again for sending this one in. This was a good one. I yeah, love it. So, anyways, we'll uh, hear what you guys have to say again. Thanks so much for being out there subscribing. Certainly can't do this without you guys. So thank you so much for tuning in. Like, share, subscribe, and believe.
Do it.